here we are with the Samsung Galaxy Note, which is going to be available on AT&T's LTE network. That's their super fast 4G network. The Galaxy Note falls somewhere between a phone and a tablet. It runs the same system as our Galaxy S2 phones. It's Android gingerbread, but it's also got this 5.3 inch HD Super AMOLED screen. So that's a 1280 by 800 pixel resolution. Really looks great for watching movies. You can get more of a web page on there. What also makes the note unique is this S Pen. So with the S Pen, you can tap a couple times on the screen and start taking notes. It's pressure sensitive. So the harder I press, the softer, the, uh, the, the deeper the stroke that you're gonna get. And in addition with the S Pen, you can take a screenshot and then you can annotate the screenshot or clip out just the parts you want. So you could do this for a photo or a web page or a PowerPoint presentation. But if I just want to send one little part, I can crop that out, paste that into a message and send it along as a message or an email or paste it into whatever I'm working on. The Galaxy Note has a 1.5 gigahertz dual core processor inside. It has 16 gigabytes of storage memory, plus uh, it has a micro SD card slot, so you can put in up to another 32 gigabytes with the SD card. Okay. But so it's capped at 32, it's not. Uh, as far as the uh, OS build, I know it's currently running well, Gingerbread. Gingerbread 2.3.6. Any roadmap information as far as upgrades or not Not yet, currently? not yet. Yeah, the international version, uh, we have announced we'll be getting ice cream sandwich, but we haven't announced any plans for the AT&T edition. Okay, and as far as battery life, uh -huh. uh, what are we looking at? It has a 2500 milliamp hour battery in it, which is really, really huge. We don't have specific talk times for it, but I'm sure that's going to get you through a full day of use. Okay, and then the, uh, the pen that's to the right. Um... This is called the S Pen Holder. The S Pen Holder actually you just slot an S Pen inside. This makes it more comfortable. If you're gonna be doing a lot of writing with the pen, maybe you don't wanna kinda of hold this little stylus here. So you get the S Pen holder, which has the button and the same features. <laughs> I'm not doing this right. <laughs> um, and it makes it comfortable if you wanna write more during a day. Yeah, just a more natural feeling uh, as opposed to the traditional stylus, which Exactly, and no if you get the S Pen holder, you also get an extra S Pen too, just in case uh, you need an extra one to carry around. Okay, and as far as other accessories? Uh, we have this, this is actually a really cool cover. This doesn't come with the phone, it's an extra accessory, but it replaces both the battery cover and it gives you this flip out cover here for one nice piece, and we have this in a variety of cool colors too. We also have uh, car mount adapters and uh, that sort of thing. Yeah, all the traditional accessories we would expect from Samsung. Absolutely. Um, uh, docking station. Um, docking station for the Galaxy Note? Or any as far as the desk dock, I haven't seen the desk dock yet. Which doesn't mean we don't have it, it just means I haven't seen it. Okay, but so there's nothing yet officially to support HDMI out, in other words. Um, not that I know of yet. But there could be. Yeah, we're not ruling anything out. Right. And um, uh, the front-facing camera's rated uh -huh. at 2 megapixels. Right, it's an 8 megapixel on the back, 2 megapixel up front. It also does 1080p video recording. Okay, and I'm going to guess that's at 30 frames. Is um, that... At least 24. Okay. Yeah, yeah so maybe 30. I'm not positive. Okay, and uh, again, the release is going to be sometime in 2012. Sometime soon, yes. And as far as any other carriers, that'll also be something down the road we'll learn. And Right now, we're only announcing AT&T. And uh, no Wi-Fi model either officially. Nothing like that, no. Okay, and again, the, there is also an international version that's yep, yep. already out as There's well. There's one that's already out in Europe and internationally. Yeah, yep. that's also GSM-based, of course. You got it. Okay, appreciate the time, Philip. My pleasure.